All right. Hi, Leo. I hope that you are doing well. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as North Node. Let's go ahead and get you an energy oracle card and see what messages you need right now. Ooh, let go. And there is only one light. So with there is only one light coming out along with let go, I feel like there's some situation that's blinding you or that's keeping you in the dark. So this could be um, limiting thought beliefs. This could be an actual person, but there's something that you're holding on to where it's time to just sever the cord to it. And when you do that, um, you're going to make room for more clarity, more light to come into your life. So, um, you know, you're going to be clearing out the space and making room for the new. So that is what I get for you, Leo. Short, sweet, to the point. Now let's see about your tarot messages here. All right. So this is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. How is their love interest feeling for them in this connection? So let's see. How is your love interest feeling for you, Leo, right now? Significant Leo placements watching this video. Ooh, we have the lovers. <laughs> So your person's, your person's feeling passionate about you. Some of you could be dealing with a Gemini, but I see this more as a spiritual connection. This is someone that, um, that feels chemistry with you. They feel passionate about you. How does your person feel for you, Leo? Let's see here. Not the death card. <laughs> and you know what? The death card has came out quite a bit. So you could be dealing with a Scorpio. So for some of you, your person, they don't want you talking to anybody else because the lovers is about a choice, right? They want you to end it with any other option. For others of you, they feel like they could be seeing you go through some type of transformation or they themselves, they want to transform this connection. For some of you, they feel that... Um, they want to put an end to any type of games and manipulation, anything like that that's happened. Let me go ahead and clarify how your person feels for you, Leo. What is this? Not the Knight of Pentacles reverse. <laughs> so your pen your your pinnacle. Your person feels like there is not movement being made within this connection. Um, they could feel feel like it's that way because someone else is involved. Um, this is Taurus Virgo Capricorn energy here. Um, yeah, they could feel like things are hidden here with the moon, Cancer Pisces energy. They feel like um, there's many things that they don't know about you. They feel like you're not taking any type of action towards them. Um, they could feel like something else is ending in your life that you're focusing on. Yeah, we have ooh, we have the Hierophant here. Um, so some of you, they feel like you could be ending a job because the Hierophant does, you know, represent like institutions. They feel like, um, you could be, you know, ending a job. Some of you, they feel like you could be ending a marriage. I mean, some type of outside commitment that you're already in, or for some of them, they feel like you just want to end it with them. <laughs> they feel like you're not, you're not interested. They feel like you are focused elsewhere. I feel like you're focusing on your spirituality. Look, she's meditating. She's, um, you know, trying to find her peace. I feel like, uh, and for, for a lot of you, this is your own awakening that you're going through with the death card here and the Hierophant. And you have polar opposites here. You have Scorpio energy and you have Taurus energy. So it's like you're balancing your light and your dark shadow aspects. Now, I'm not saying your person's seeing all that, but that's what I'm seeing here for you. Um, okay. So how are you feeling for your person, Leo? How are you feeling for your person? All right. Not the tower. Did you guys just have a breakup or something? You feel like there is a sudden shift within this connection. Some of you feel like it has ended and it ended in an ugly way. Some of you guys are definitely dealing with a Scorpio. Um... How are you feeling for your person? Or some of you guys feel like that your person is going through a tower moment in their life. Maybe they're the one ending some type of, you know, karmic outside connection. Or maybe things are kind of falling apart for them right now. How are you seeing your person? What is that? The two of swords in reverse. The ace of swords. So some of you feel like your person wants to communicate with you. Um... And um, 
you guys don't know when it's going to happen. That's like unexpected communication, the tower and the ace of swords. But with the two of swords in reverse, you can feel like your person is not making a decision. They're avoiding making a decision. Um, or for some of you, I mean, the two of swords upright is indecision. So in the reverse, you could also see it as in, you know, they had two things they were confused about and they finally just decided to, um, to drop it and make a decision, which left them with what, with one sword, right? So they want to come in to speak their truth. So let's see, how do you see your person, Leo? This is an interesting one. Queen of swords. <laughs> you guys aren't playing. <laughs> You guys aren't playing with this person. I feel like you guys have been through it. I feel like you want the truth. You want clarity. You want, don't want any more lies. I feel like there could have been some type of, you know, betrayal or just dishonesty with this connection. And it's like too many illusions, right? Like I see all the, the you know, the birds here talking about communication. It's like you guys just want clear communication and get to the truth of things. And I feel like uh, with the Ten of Wands, yeah. You, some of you guys feel like your person is stressed, overburdened. Some of you guys feel that way yourself dealing with this connection. Okay, so let's get a near future outcome for the Leos watching this video and their love connection. What is going to be happening for the Leos watching this video? This love connection. Two of Pentacles. What else flipped over? We have the King of Wands. So somebody wants to take action. Look, he's making a plan, right? He's looking at the Atlas. Um, someone has a lot going on with the Two of Pentacles, so they're still juggling. All right, near future outcome with this connection. Let's get one more card on the bottom of the deck here. Seven of Swords. Yeah, in reverse. Good thing. And then we have the Ace of Wands. So yeah, there's an opportunity here for like a new passionate beginning. Um... I will say I see an absence of cups here in these spreads. So I feel like you guys are feeling like you need this new spark <laughs> because this is like this relationship must be on its last leg. I don't know what's going on, but I feel like you guys, um, you know, someone is still deciding on whether or not they want to, you know, it's like they don't want to lie. They don't want to get caught up anymore. They don't want there to be any type of deceit anymore. The seven of swords in reverse. It's like they do want to take action and they do want a new passionate beginning. Um, so that opportunity is here for you guys. I see that coming in. So let's go ahead and get, let's get some songs from your person, from their heart space. For the Leos watching this video, how is their person feeling for them collectively? Can we get a song for them? <sighs> oh, we have Neo, we have six. So, um, or so sick. It says, it's ridiculous. It's been months. And for some reason, I just can't get over us. And I'm stronger than this. Enough is enough. No more walking around with my head down. I'm so over being blue and crying over you. This is a beautiful song. I actually really love this song. So you guys should check this one out. So that is what I have for you, Leo. If you like this video and it resonated, um, please hit the like button for me as well as subscribe. That'll help more people to see the video and help my channel to grow. And I appreciate you guys for being here. Okay. Bye Leo.